100 watt LED floodlight unboxing and teardown with repair hints. The floodlight that we are unboxing today is cheap, but lights up a vast area. You can find this on eBay for 30 to 40 US dollars. Okay, there it is. There's no bubble wraps or any packing material inside the box. But outside of the box was fully wrapped at the time of arrival. It has around 14 inches long wire with soldered ends. Next, we are going to power up the floodlight and measure the lighting level. For this we use a lux meter. My camera cannot handle the extreme light levels, therefore you will experience some issues. Lux level is around 650, which is more than office lighting according to Wikipedia. Now you know how powerful the floodlight is. Next we will tear down the light, and see how we can perform a repair, if something goes wrong. Dismantling the light looks super easy. Loosening the screw should do the trick. Carefully handle the rubber seal which protects the light from entering water. Remove the screws that holds the reflector in place. Oops, the reflector looks very thin. It even bends when you hold it tight. Anyway, the thickness is not essential to solving the purpose of reflecting. Whatever it is, the light looks totally worth the price. Check carefully, all the key components except the LEDs are protected from moisture. LED plate is 12.5 cm by 10 cm. There is no external driver that powers the board. Therefore, if something goes wrong, all you have to do is change the COV LED plate. Luckily this is available on eBay and AliExpress for a low price. Shared links in the description will help you find the right match for your floodlight. Also, even the size is slightly different, there's ample space to mount it inside the housing. Okay, now the floodlight is reassembled, let's test it again. Also, this time we will test the temperature as well. Light powers up as usual, the tester temperature shows 36.6 Celsius in less than 5 seconds, and it goes up to 45 Celsius within 10 seconds, and becomes stable at 50 to 55 Celsius. Overall this floodlight looks really worth the price.